Okay, everybody, we're going to be having Friday the 13th here. Jimmy Big Money playing Friday the 13th against Jason. Uh, Mr. Peanut Head. Mr. Peanut Head, huh? With a mask. Well, okay, go ahead and start chopping. All right. <laughs> Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna be throwing some stuff. I'm gonna I'm gonna play somewhat of a way that I know how to beat it. So yeah, here we go. I mean, there's a lot of people that don't like this game, but I kind of do because it's the only NES game that I can beat. We're gonna get you beat. <laughs> no, you can beat uh, Mega Man Three or Mega Man Two. Mega Man Two. Yeah, that's another game we'll probably end up playing. Alright, I got the... Wrong game, man. Uh-oh. Okay. Wrong way, Mark. Wrong, wrong way on a one-way train, huh? Well, <laughs> there's always medicine there. Now I gotta get this note. My plan is, is to get the flame. Get the flame, man. Torch. The Tiki Torch. The torch. <laughs> and keep jumping like an idiot to get stuff. Uh, I didn't want to go in there. Why did you do it? I, I, <laughs> try, I tried to get the butter knife and it didn't go. There's always a key over here. I don't know why they give you a butter knife. That's not a very good defense. You know, butter knife is probably the last weapon I'd want, you know, chasing down Jason, man. <laughs> yeah. Alright, I gotta hurry up here. Go in this cabin. If you have the key, come back out. Go back in. Then you get this. Fire roll damage. Peanut head the most. Alright. So we gotta go find Peanut Head. I don't know if I'm gonna make it. I think a counselor might die. Uh oh. Okay. Yeah, I think a counselor might die. Uh, I need to get in here. Quick. Alright, who is it? It's not Fat Boy. It's not Chrissy, Debbie, no, it's Paul, he's almost dead, alright, alright, he ain't dead now, go back to Mark, now I can go and get the flame, I got the flame. Now I just gotta hunt down Mr. Peanut Head. Try not to jump at this point because knives keep coming. But you don't want to get that because then you're screwed on getting the flame, the flame, or I mean the torch again. <coughs> Where's Mr. Peanut Head? Oh, well, he's 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 more like a raisin. And if you kill, I think it's like sixty zombies, you get a. Of course. If you kill 60 zombies, you get a machete. Ah, oh, you got him. Well, uh, just for that point. For now. Oh, just for now. You didn't get him all the way. No. That sucks. I still gotta hunt him. Usually he likes to go to the right, so I'm going to go to the right. Sometimes he'll pop out, and of course he's at that cabin. 
he's he's usually somewhat in a pattern here's here's a trick you go to a counselor that's in a cabin you switch on another counselor pick on mark get out of the cabin and, and fight him on the on the road it's easier and then just keep chasing him that's he might have went this way no I don't think he did That's the problem, problem with, with this game. So you gotta be really stingy with the torch. Let's see if we can get a kill in on him. Do you know where he's at? Yeah, I know where he's at. He's right in here. Alright, do the trick again. Switch. Bam. Sometimes he's at the door. Beat him the first day. All right, my uh, my objective on the second day is to get the sweater, so I'll automatically go to the cave. And he's already stalking another counselor. Right here, when you jump here, there's always a potion here. Not usually there, but around around in that area. Yeah. Alright. Jason's mom. She's kinda of ugly. I don't know if you, if you stay here and do this pattern. Yeah. You got it. Way all the way over there. Right. George Fat Boy. How did you learn your way around this game, Jimmy? Um, there's a guy on uh, on YouTube that actually uh, had the you know the walkthrough. Well, it's kind of a walkthrough, but he, he showed you how to get the torch easy, and then I just kept playing the game. Because I was like, I've never beaten this game before and I want to beat it. Yeah. Usually after one person he stalks, usually comes over here. Because he usually goes for the children. You see, you just go in here. I mean, once you kind of learn his pattern, you know, you... This game gets kind of easy. Hey, if you guys have any tips on how to help Jimmy get a, a faster time on this game, man. Nah, it ain't, it's, I've tried it. You might, man. You no, know. it's... I've tried it so many times, it, it don't work. <laughs> And I have, I have no idea if I'm going to beat this because I need more potions. I'm kind of going kamikaze on this. 
How many potions do you have? I have one left, and look how much life I got. I only get some potions. Well, that's what I'm going for. Need at least two more. Now I'm now I'm getting lost. Well, fine. You need the potion, man. You don't know where they're gonna be. I think there's an axe here. No. Okay. I think I go this way. Yeah. Ooh. Perfect. Perfect. Now you get the potions. Do this trick again. Alright, now on to the third day. Awesome. You're gonna get him. Jimmy's gonna get Jason. Mr. Peanut Head. Usually on the third day, I like to, uh, where is it? Sometimes on the third day he'll go straight for the kids or a counselor, so I'll just I'll just sit right here until he stalks somebody. See so now there's a machete. trick again and at the cave area he normally runs to the left so go to the left and if he doesn't show up that means he's going for the kids and I think he might be going for the kids this time nope I think I got him here yeah get him, get him Jimmy I think it went for the kids. Uh -huh. Oh no. I was just there, wasn't I? Alright, I got him. Boom. There you go. I could do better, yeah. but that was, that was good. Well, that, take care, everybody, man. We'll see you in our next video. Yeah, uh, thank you guys for watching. This is our first video game video, and I think we're going to be doing some more, hopefully in the future. Thank you, guys. Have a good day.